डायलॉग सामस रजमान एंड टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट फॉर गोइंग वन फूड ट्रीट्स ईसोनोफिलिक ईसोफाजाइटिस एज वेल एज एक्सक्लूडिंग सिक्स फाइन स्टडी एलिमिनेटिंग एनिमल मिल्क अलोन फ्रॉम द डाइट ऑफ अडल्स विद ईसोनोफिलिक ईसोफाजाइटिस और ईओई इज एज इफेक्टिव एट ट्रीटिंग द डिजीज एज एलिमिनेटिंग एनिमल मिल्क प्लस फाइव अदर कॉमन फूड्स एंड एनआईएच फंडेड क्लिनिकल ट्रायल हैज फाउंड For people with EOE whose disease remains active after they forego animal milk, a more restrictive diet may help them achieve remission, according to the researchers. Now, EOE is a chronic disease characterized by an overabundance of white blood cells called eosinophils in the esophagus. The new findings come from the first multi-site randomized trial comparing the 6 FED with a one food elimination diet or 1 FED in adults with EOE. The trial involved 129 adults aged 18 to 60 years with a confirmed EOE diagnosis, active EOE symptoms and a high number of eosinophils in esophageal tissue. Participants were assigned at random to either the 1 FED which eliminated only animal milk from the diet or the 6 FED. They followed their assigned diet for 6 weeks then underwent an upper endoscopy exam and an esophageal tissue biopsy. The investigators found that 34% of participants on 6 FED and 40% of participants on 1 FED achieved remission after 6 weeks of diet therapy, a difference that was not statistically significant. The two diets also had a similar impact across several other measures including reduction in EOE symptoms and effect on quality of life. Thus 1 FED and 6 FED were equally effective at treating EOE which was an unexpected finding. The researchers also discovered that nearly half of people who did not respond to 1 FED attained remission after treatment with the more restrictive 6 FED while more than 80% of the non-responders to 6 FED achieved remission with oral steroids. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for latest updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe, and press the bell icon.